Neoliberal theory is based on strong individual property rights, free trade, the rule of law, market independence and individual freedoms. These are the essential elements of wealth creation and societal innovation imagined by the pioneers of neoliberalism, who saw this form of wealth creation as a means to alleviate poverty and create a fair society based on the market. The theory of neoliberalism has never been categorically defined, but it is generally seen as an economic theory. The gap between the theory and how neoliberalism has been performed in practice is stark. Neoliberal practices have increased class disparity, eaten away at welfare reform, commodified labour, endangered the environment and narrowed the stratum in which wealth is shared. The Keynesian approach to economics that was prevalent after the Second World War began to be replaced by a theory and practice of economics more influenced by monetarism as policy began to move away from the state and focus more on the individual capacity to generate monetary success. Thatcherism and Reaganism in the 1980s saw neoliberal policies put into practice, and they were swiftly followed by the aggressive expansionism of George Bush and the third-way politics of Bill Clinton and Tony Blair at the turn of the century. In general, neoliberalism has seen the demise of state-owned enterprise, trade unions, and has embraced market thinking. The markets dominate lives and world powers aggressively pursue new markets and dominate energy sources to find new places in which to invest surplus capital. Some suggest that it's an attack on democracy, whilst there is also a belief that it is a globalist project that seeks to concentrate power within transnational organisations. The individual is now key in society as groups break up and everyone bears responsibility for themselves. Whatever the reality of neoliberalism, it is the predominant economic force in the world today, and it has invaded every aspect of life, including the social and cultural. Society either needs to adapt and embrace this reality, or fight back. Thanks for watching this two-minute theory on neoliberalism, and please look in the description below for books you should check out for more in-depth explanation. If you found that interesting, you may be interested in other two-minute theories. And finally, please don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you soon.